Well, hello, this is Alex, now coming to you from my new garage, which is, um, as you can see, full of boxes. Um, luckily, my, my tools have arrived, uh, including my trusty DeWalt drill, which has been with me for many years. Um, if you saw my last video, you'll see that I have a pair of these um, push-button lock um, privacy knobs on the doors to my master bedroom, which unfortunately tend to lock themselves whenever you open the door, which leads to a lockout situation which my wife just experienced and which we would prefer not to have happen again. Luckily she lives with a master amateur locksmith. So I spent a little time analyzing the uh, mechanism of this thing and basically what happens is there's a square um, driver or drive post that extends from the, uh, the out exterior handle uh, through the latch mechanism into this handle. Um, and so when you turn the knob, that little square part there turns, right? And so it requires that this, that this interior handle be able to turn. So when you push the little privacy knob, those two little, do you see those there? Those two little prongs pop out and engage on this bar here, or this piece of metal, and now that center part can't turn until they're released. And the way they get released is there's a, I don't know, actually you might be able to see it, but somewhere in there there's a detent. Oh, you can see it actually. See that plastic thing down there? If you, uh, if you press the right thing in the center of the exterior doorknob, it presses a little wedge-shaped thing into that, which releases the mechanism and the, the, the knob pops back out. So I'm thinking to myself, it's Christmas Eve, I'm not going to be able to fix anything for, or get new knobs or anything for a while. What can I do? I'm staring at this, I'm looking at this little bridge piece. It doesn't seem to perform any function other than engage those two little locking, those little locking dogs. So I'm going to take my drill and I'm going to drill out these two beautifully, in, um, beautifully installed rivets which seem to hold everything together these days. Remove that thing and see if that doesn't solve our problem. Stay tuned. And we're back. This is Alex again. I have milled off with my beautiful high-speed steel quarter-inch drill bit there, drilled out the rivets on this godforsaken handle, and removed this piece of metal from there, which engages with these little locking dogs, which you can see better now. See them popping out? Maybe against the wall, you could... Ooh, there we go. Very impressive. And now, um, when the when the uh, thing attempts to turn it, um, there's nothing to stop it, and the whole thing will just release and go, which it wouldn't do before. So I just have to go do this to the other door, put this back together. No one will be the wiser, and um, I now have a not so privacy knob for my bedroom until I can get something better. So there you go. Hack your bedroom door. So, Merry Christmas again, Happy New Year's, and thanks for watching. As always, have fun, and please keep it legal. Cheers.